guys. So today I want to show you how I paint the backs of my tanks. Uh, I started doing this a little while ago just because I don't like the regular, you know, stick on backgrounds you buy. So I started painting the back of my tanks and I use, this is just a black spray paint that I picked up. This has a paint and a primer. So it usually covers in one to two coats. But all I do is I take some painter's tape and I put it on the plastic edges, like on the top and bottom. And I put it covering kind of just that one piece of glass on the seam there. And then I simply take my spray paint and paint it. And it's really that simple. And I'll go over the whole thing and show you what it looks like. Alright guys, got it all painted. And sometimes this takes two coats. Sometimes I can do it in one. It just depends. So it's wet now. When it dries, what I'll do is I'll set the tank up. That's the bottom of it. But I'll set the tank up and look through it from the other side and make sure that the coverage is good. That light's kind of glaring real good. Um, now this will get a lot lighter when it when it dries. It'll become like a uh, like a flat black looking. It won't be shiny at all. So once it dries, I'll make sure it looks good from the front side. Make sure there's no lighter spots or darker spots. If there is, I'll put a second coat on. If not, then I'll leave it how it is. So you'll see this uh, tank in another video coming up shortly. I'm gonna go over a little bit about dirted tanks. So I'm gonna use this tank. So you'll be able to see the finished product once it's done. I just wanted to show you how I do it and how easy it is. Gives a real cool look. It makes your tank, it hides all your wires and stuff for one, but two, it makes your tank look a little deeper. So it's pretty neat effect, really easy, really cheap. Try it sometime on an extra tank. And if you ever get tired of it, seeing as it's glass, all you do is you take a razor blade and you can scrape that, dry, that dried paint right off of there. And it comes right off. It won't stay on there permanently. Now, it's only going to come off if you scrape it. So you don't have to worry about it falling off over time or anything. It won't do that. But if you ever get tired of it, you scrape it right off. You can spray a different color on there. I don't know. I don't think I would ever use anything besides black. Black gives a little bit deeper looking effect, but you're free to use whatever color you want. It's a neat thing. Customize your tank real simple and cheap. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you on the next one.